hello guys welcome to how to fix track in this video guys we are going to fix the issue the program can't start because the mcvcp 140.dll is missing from your computer so you might be getting the another error like the there was a problem starting msbc v 140.dll could not be found error loading msbc 140.dll so whatever error you are getting these all are related to msbcp 140.dll error so how to troubleshoot this issue so let me explain you why you are getting this issue so there could be the missing dll file from your windows as well as the this is the microsoft c++ distributor package for visual studio 2015 and is often required to running programs developed with the c++ so the main cause of this issue is msvcp 140.dll file is missing from your windows if this doesn't fix the issue we need to install the microsoft c++ distributor image on our windows for 32 bit as well as for 64 bit operating base system okay so let's start without wasting your time so first of all open the google chrome and you need to type there msvcp 140.dll download and go to first link this is the official website of dll file you need to scroll down and you need to look for architecture 64 bit mostly system are using 64 bit but how to check that go to search bar tap the system information open system information in the system type you should be getting the 64 bit based pc if you are getting 32 bit i will show you to install the correct patch for that so this is the 64 bit so click on download this option and this will install the msvc 140 dll file now you can see steps is already written here you can choose accordingly so we will also follow these methods like for this okay 64 this is for 32 bit and this is for 64 bit this one so let me go back and show you how to install for 32 bit you can see here the architecture is 32 bit click on download option the same will be downloaded once you download it, go to download section. This one. This is in a zip file. Okay, so now you need to unzip this. This is a zip file. Right click and extract here. And you can see msbcp140.dll just copy that and go to c drive and before that go to view and go to options change folder view and click on show hidden devices you should be getting this option but click on show hidden files and folders drive apply ok and as mentioned on the this screen so how to navigate to the C drive open C drive then look for windows then open system 32 press S on your keyboard system 32 is for 64 bit base and this one is for 60 32 bit base system so we need to go to the system 32 ok and just paste it like this click on replace the file in the destination continue and you can see the file has been replaced if you are using the 32 bit base system open this folder syswaw 64 bit and paste it here ok once the paste is done just restart your system and it should fix your issue after the restart if your issue is still not fixed we can move to the second method 
in the second method we will install the redistributable image C++ so on the search bar you need to type for visual C++ distributable and click on latest support and scroll down look for this option visual the latest one open that and it will give the same link okay now this is for 32 bit and this is for 64 bit click on that and it will start the downloading process and you can also download both once both are downloaded just open the download you can see one by one both are with the same name but the 64 bit and the 86 bit just double click on it and click on run and you can see I have already installed it that's why I'm getting the repair option you need to click on install install and also install this patch also if you are using the 32 bit or the 64 bit both you need to install both two patches 64 and 32 bit whether you are using the 64 or 32 bit operating system once the installation is done just restart your system and it will fix your issue so this is how you can troubleshoot this issue so hope your issue is fixed now if your issue is fixed then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching how to fix tech